Alan East running onto the field, and you see air attack quite a bit, not, a, not unexpected in this one. Tyler Klum getting it to the corner of the end zone. Braden Crumrine with the touchdown. Alan East on top, 7-0. How about some other passing? Getting out of trouble, Klum takes the hit, but going up and getting that, that's Braden Crumrine. Gavin Maxwell with the touchdown earlier, but Columbus Grove would come back. Blake Reynolds with the touchdown, running that in to give Columbus Grove the lead and then putting them up maybe for good, going deep over the middle, hits Gabe Clement, his favorite target this season. It's 20 to 10. Looks like Columbus Grove is gonna pull away from this one, but Allen East not done yet. Fourth and 10, seven minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. Going across the middle, pass complete to Jacob Hirschberger for the first down. New life in the Mustang drive. And then next play, Klum takes it in himself. And now it's a three-point game, 20 to 17. Time ticking down, down to a minute 48 left in the fourth quarter. Crum rolling, finds Jacob Hirschberger all alone. And he takes it into the house for a touchdown, 24-20. Allen East, but a minute 43 remaining for Blake Reynolds and Columbus Grove, and Reynolds goes to work. Reynolds hitting John Banal across the middle for the first down, putting them just outside of the 25-yard line, the 20-yard line, and then a couple plays later, it's Reynolds going over the top. Jackson Schrader behind the defense and puts it in. 27 seconds left. That proves to be the game-winning touchdown for Columbus Grove. They win 27 to 24, while the replay for you Tomorrow morning at 10 a.m., Mark Shine caught up with Columbus Grove head coach Andy Schaefer. We're here with the winning Northwest Conference champion, Coach, coach Andy Schaefer. First of all, Coach, let's start out with this. What a great night for your conference to end up like this. It was neat. It was special. And uh, I couldn't have dreamt it uh, even better for our, us to, to get together, our athletic direct directors, and say, let's have a conference champion. Let's have somebody that win it outright. And I tell you what, it was a heck of a game. Coach, your kids were down 10 to nothing, but your middle two quarters, you played big boy football and got after the run. Yeah, it was. You know, that was the first time we've been down all season. And, and so for us to actually kind of fight through that adversary and, and not really go with the passing game of Blake Reynolds and Gabe Clement, uh, we got the running game going. And Colin Mesker and the offensive line did a heck of a job. They really did. And, Coach, you started out last year with this crew. You were one and three. And since that time, you guys have got figured out and really playing well since then. We are. We are. And we're, we're excited to see what will happen. And uh, we knew that it was going to be a grind in the Northwest Conference. We knew that every game got bigger, especially after you got through those first three weeks. And it certainly did. And so we're excited to see what happens. I like the way that we've built uh, this, this team. And I think we can make some damage. The 2020 Northwest Conference champion, Andy Schaefer. Back to you. 